Alright guys, what's up? It's episode 12 of Pokemon Sword Let's Play. Sorry, I have not uploaded on Monday. I promise I will be giving you guys your episodes Wednesdays and Friday. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So, this will be the continuation of episode 11. And we do have a few Pokemon that we need to show off. So, while I was grinding, we got some Pokemon that we got traded to us in our Wonder Trade. So we got a Garuki, a Scorbunny, a Mimikyu, a Sobble, a Ice Q, a Larvitar, Wingle, Togepi, Jolbur, Treepy, Senti Scor- uh, Sizzle- Sizzlepede. Oh, Sinisty, a Hardish, a Hatena. We got a, a rain, uh, not a rainbow, but the berry version of Al Creamy. The Love Cream. <coughs> we also got a Bergamite from there. We got also got another Mimikyu. And uh, a Gumi. And pretty much it that I know. Oh, Lotad as well. Alright, there's more over here. The Hone Edge. The Sneasel. Um, the other Mimikyu. The other Dreepy. Um, a Cutie Fly. Pretty much all the things that you would expect that we got for for wonder trading, which was nice. And of course we also got an Eldegoss Eldegoss from it as well. So we we've done what we needed to do. So now it's time to take on the seven gym. So let's let's do this. But I also want to go and see what uh, when we start Pokemon on Pokemon jobs, so let's see how they did. Check Poke jobs. We got completed, so we needed Pokemon to try on clothes. It was our dark types. Yes, we did pretty good. <coughs> Great job. Your Pokemon came back from the job. It seems like your Pokemon did an exceptional job. They received lots of experience points for doing a great job. Whew, that's a lot. Yep, and we got a Moo Jeez, okay. Safety checks, let's see what we got. Oh wait, no. Wait, no. So let's see what these guys did. <sighs> Yay, they did good. Great job. Did an exceptional job. They received lots of experience. The client seems happier than they've ever been without but your Pokemon. Keep up the good work. It seems like Joltek has something to give you. We got two soda pops. So assembling the change would be steel type. Okay, so I think really it's gonna be Ralph Hatena. Do we have any other Pokemon that's cute? Hatena, Togepi. Yeah, it's gonna be like those one, those ones. So technically, I don't want to do anything with them yet. Do, 
Oh uh, yeah, Ice Pokemon, Steel Pokemon, Kudaku Pokemon, and safety checks. We need some help doing maintenance so we could get Pokemon, get Pokemon that are good with high places. That would be great. So it'd be air. So it'd be like flying types. All right, it's time to go fly to our boys up here. Got nine. We're gonna go right here. This is the outskirts, I think. Yep, it's the outskirts. We got a stronger Marini. Dire hits. What are you doing? Let's see if we can catch this. Because it's a stronger Marini, so that would be interesting. Uh, I'm going to use Stir Chop and hope it does not kill. It did not kill, but it's got toxic spikes. Interesting. Use the lovely Ultra Ball. Watch us catch it. We caught it. What is your new move sets? Yep. Cheers, sure, it's level 53. And I don't want that, but. Oh, we did not check. Okay, we get a check. Let's see what that marine knew. It's toxic spikes, liquidation, venom drench. Venom drench. Opposing Pokemon are drenched in their odd poisonous liquid. This lowers attack, special attack, and speed of a poison target. Oh, that is actually a pretty good Musa to have. But unfortunately, I'm not using uh, our Marini. Alright, let's do this. We've dilly dallied way too much. It's time to beat the seven gym leader. So let's see what we got. That's a big clob plus over there. Jeez, it's so big. Okay, let's see what Marini is saying. With the door, with the shutter closed, no one's going to be able to challenge the gym. I gotta look into this. I just happen to have too many of these, so I'll give you one. Got it? You can handle yourself, right? Yes, Marini, I can. Oi! Welcome to Spike Moth, kid. Hope you're ready for the gym challenge. Hold on, mate. If you're going to take on the gym mission, you better change into your uniform. That's so horrible. If you're looking for the gym leader, he's straight ahead from here. Are you sure about that? Because once I start going forward, your people are going to jump me. I know they are. Yep, there they are. Gym challenger. You want to get past me, but I don't want that. Basically, it's a battle between our desires. Team Yale. Yeet, yeet, yeet. You're going to send down a linen. Good Pokemon that you got there, boy. But... I've literally, literally won. Your Pokemon aren't good enough. Oh god. You and your Pokemon broke through. 
<laughs> well, duh. What Pokemon's better? I don't want to let you through. That's why I was waiting all squeezed in this crack. But since I lost, it really was. It was really all for nothing. Whatever you want, so I guess I'll step aside. I really don't like the team Yellow Grants. They're more of a nuisance than a pro a freaking evil team. What's over here? What's over here? Yeah. What's this? A gym challenger made it through? All us Team Yell members have blocked the way. Don't think we'll just let you waltz through. Alright. Well, you're gonna lose. I can already tell you that. I'm the better trainer. Technically, I could beat all of you and run circles around you. Without even having to worry. Goodbye, Thievel. You're not worth it. Bye. Bye. Team Yell lost. I wasn't able to properly greet you. Too bad. Those greetings were really good. That was totally unbelievable. Even my Pokemon are in awe of you and your team. Here, go on through. Check out the ne our neon signs while you're at it. <sighs> while you're at it. Yes, <laughs> Mr. Mime, you, meet, you better get away. I'm a bad, bad dude. That's a regular. Mr. Mime. It's not a... Dalarian. Mr. Mime. Alright, let's go. I'm yelling for no reason! Kaboom! Did I surprise you? I'm a little surprised how much my legs hurt from that landing. If I stand still like this for too long, it'll hurt so bad I might cry. So I'll shake it off with a battle. Why would you even do that? You're injuring yourself. That makes no sense, my dude. Yes. Send out the Scrafty. Send out that lovely Scrafty. I think I still win in speed. Get out of here. You and your 42s. <coughs> There's a reason my Pokemon are stronger, because I know what's going to happen in the championship. I lost my leg pains back again. So it's a double shock. Well, it's true that I lost, but I pushed through the pain, so you should praise me for that. Alright, now that the pain's gone, I guess I better get out of here. You guys are nothing but just idiotic people. Oh, I know this is gonna be body, body. Body? Body. The HP of your Pokemon not looking so good. I practiced that backhand spring so much even a pop star would be jealous of this of these move of those moves. Were you surprised? Boy, be surprised you. Well, you, while you're in utter shock, I'm gonna sneakily win this battle. Are you sure? Because I don't think you're ready for it. <laughs> Get those wee vials out of here. You're not going to win nothing. Oh. 
Surface level 51. Huh? Seriously? You gotta be kidding. It's over, over already? Why? What, you think you're beating someone? I should have been practicing my bow skills, not my backflip skills. Thanks for showing me that. Guess I'll cheer for you from now on. Yeah, you better go. Kentonian Mr. Mime. No one wants to see you. Team Yell takes the field. This might be the gym challenge, but I won't let you ruin our cool secret hangout. Alright, time for a pincer attack. We'll do whatever it takes to win. Ah! I didn't have enough time to get my disguise ready. That's right, Team Yell is actually made up of Spike Pop gym trainers. Oh, pretty bad Pokemon. Just saying. <laughs> Bye, Leopard. Get that drapian out of here. Get that drapey on out of here. <coughs> yep, Intellion's 50, 50, 53. Toxtricity's 51. Rabidash is 51. <coughs> it would have been better if you just lost to us. Deadly says. Um, as a member of Team Yell, or as or was I beaten as a gym trainer? Either way, ugh, whatever. Our gym leader's up next, but he's really strong. Got that? I mean, everyone already knew the true identity of Team Yell, right? That means I won't get in trouble for not getting my disguise on, right? I sure hope so. Get out of here, you dinguses! Shut your gob. Oh, Danny. Uh, I'm really sorry. The lot from Spike Moth's telling me that they telling me they locked down the city for my sake. Spike Moth's just getting keep just keeps getting worse and worse, and all Pierce says is don't worry. So so we decided to disguise ourselves as Team Yell and sabotage the other gym challengers. We thought if we could stop the other gym challengers from reaching the gym, then Miss Marnie would be the only one to win and make it to the Champion Cup. And we figured that increased the chances of our wonderful Miss Marnie becoming the new champion. 
that's no way to help someone at all. Dang, no need to bother with all the preparations or whatever. Go on and face the gym leader. Oh gosh. I wish there was actually voice actors for this. So you're finally here, huh? See, I'm really not a great gym leader. Figured that's no why no one was coming to challenge me. I have good ears, so I overhold the whole thing about the sea being shut up. When I was alone, it was like my soul was weeping. This is a simple gym stadium. We can't even Dynamax our Pokemon, but well, I still hope you enjoy the battle. <coughs> now then, I'm the gym leader of Spike Mouth. Pierce the dark type user. You want to challenge me even though you know you will lose? Then this song's for you, foolish trainer. Get ready for a mosh pit with me and my party. Spike Mouth, it's time to rock. Sends out a Scrafty. Oh, this is gonna be easy fixings. Everyone cheer on my Pokemon. Let's do it. Scrafty, intimidate the opponent. Okay. You think that's just gonna really stop me from beating you? I'm eight levels higher than you, my dude. Malamar. Malamar's gonna mess you all up with his contrary ability. Okay. Psycho cut? Oh crap, that's gonna do a lot of damage. Oh, okay. Pokemon? Nah. got psycho cut come out Charizard oh psycho cuts gonna do some damage mm, not very much a critical hit but not good enough you're gonna lose so flamethrower not super effective but stab yeah. <coughs> Obstagoon, yep. Surfetch coming back out, my dude. Time to meet another pro member of my crew. Face the proud red. Proud high roar of my obscure. Start. Oh no. It's gonna do some damage. Ah crap, my defense. Oh god, this is gonna do damage. Okay. Okay. Let's see what Toxtricity can do. <laughs> oh 
Well, I, I kind of do want to revive my uh, Surfetch. Here's a number I saved just for this. You sit in the lot in the stands, better tr cheer me on. Oh, so, wait. Struct? Okay. Hey, this is, this thing's getting on my nerves, man. Really is. <laughs> Come out, come out, Sir Fetch. Or Madam Fetch, if you want to call him or her that. Is that her? I don't have to do that. This impression? Get this obstacle out of here. Gosh darn it. I really just like this move for obstruct. It is so annoying. So very annoying. Just freaking end it. End this thing. It is four times weak. Get out of here. 54 for uh, Charizard? No. I would use a lot. I'm gonna use my Inteleon. Inteleon, Inteleon. I don't do encores. Get not songs, not moves, not Pokemon. All right, buddy. Everyone's gonna stink, but who cares? Go, Suntang, use your sucker punch and toxic. Are you sure you wanna do that? Because I think I'm gonna end you. Intellion just destroyed your skunk tank. Surfetch 52. Me and my team gave it our best. Let's meet up for a battle again sometime. The <laughs> rough and gruff. I'm glad we were able to battle. Seems like my Pokemon feel the same way. <coughs> Here's your dark patch. One left to go, my dudes. One left to go. You can get now catch Pokemon up to level 55. Here's a uniform, too. I've actually been thinking about just selling them at my concerts. Dark uniform. My little sis Marnie's gonna challenge me next, I bet. That, that was actually kind of sweet. So you were watching, sis? You won't learn anything from seeing me lose. I was watching your battle, bro. It's how I learned the battle and all of that. That right? That reminds me, Marty. There's something I wanted to tell you. I want you to take over the gym here in Spike Moth as its gym leader. Yeah, I know. You plan to retire after the Champion Cup, right? I think you are really become a great Pokemon, a great gym leader, even if you don't Dynamax your Pokemon. I love you, but my answer is a big fat no. I mean, when I end up becoming champion, I won't be able to be a gym, gym leader. <coughs> Good point. In that case, let your big bro see if you have the skills, skills to be champion. Hey Danny, thanks for having an amazing Pokemon battle with my brother. It's my turn next, so clear off for a bit, okay? <laughs> yep, 
Yay, snarl. Hey, there's some trouble over Route 9. It's so bad even champions come to sort things out. Oh, hey, you gave Pierce a thrashing, didn't you? You should head over to help. Come on, then. I'll show you the way. Dude, I didn't want you to bring me out. Like, why? Kaboom! Danny, thanks for coming, but I got a handle on this. Whatever making that noise, I'll see to it. I already told you, didn't I? Keep your eye on the goal, Kakashi. And for you, that's winning the gym challenge. The only badge le gym badge left is the one you'll get from the gym dragon gym leaders, Raihan. Right? Brown is the only trainer out there I consider a real rival. He's that good, you know. And there I go again. Sorry, but I suppose this is no time for me to stopping. Be stopping for a chat. There's a bit of trouble here with my name on it, but don't you worry about a thing. The unbeatable champion is here to look after things and keep you all safe. Couple. And away we go. That came from the tunnel, wouldn't you say? Seems about to have a champion time. <sighs> I really don't give a sh crap about this, man. You better not block me from going over there. Pierce, go fight. I want to get the stupid. Oh, there's a linen and a zigzagoon. A choice specs. Boost uh, special attack. Cool, cool, cool. There's something over here that I can get through. What is this dude doing over here? <laughs> His zigzag. One cares about you, irrelevant team. God, my stomach. <coughs> yep, I'm gonna go this way to dodge the people. Did you get it to work? Yes, it's working. I to dodge these people, dodge the people. like hops here Danny this is mad you know what I mean uh where's Leon that's what I like to know that noise it was like something massive expo massive explosion there was this huge surge of red light and then wild Pokemon started dynamaxing around me brazen as you like yep here we go take a look at the news See, there's Lee. He really is the greatest, right? Lee and his Charizard took down that Dynamax Pokemon in a blink of an eye. I, re I knew Lee was strong, but this really makes you appreciate how great he is, eh? Let's go meet up with him, Danny. He should be at Hammerlock Stadium. Okay. Yeah, 
what's over here? It's evil and a berserker. No, thank you. Oh no, it's a gentleman. Oh no, gentleman's attacking me. Whatever should I do? <laughs> Gentleman Caden. He sends out a dew blade. <sighs> well, that's sad that you have a dew blade because it's going to go down. Well, it survived. Nice damager. But, I mean, yeah, you get a critical hit. <laughs> but, you're done. Get wrecked. <sighs> the acid reflux right now. Jeez. It's gonna send out past Simeon. Yes, I will. Oh, good lord. <laughs> Let's go, Dracolock. Dracolock. <coughs> it's not very effective. What? Oh, it's a fighting type. Okay. Doing some damage. But do you really think you're that good? I don't think your Pasumian's better than my Charizard. There's a fighting type, not a freaking what I thought it was. I know faulty guys. Nice Pokemon. But it's not a shot will end you. I already know it will. You may be a defensive thing, but you're not gonna live very long, my dude. Sorry dude. I'm gonna end you. How long is your play going on? I've only been on for 30, 30 minutes. I don't know, Dad. Probably soon. Well, when you get a break somehow, would you take the trash out to the dumpster and get down and get you two 12 packs of soda out of the car? Yes. Thank you. I brought up the tea this afternoon. I brought up the soda yesterday, so the two sodas left. All right. What do you? I don't want to know what you have. Is there an item over here? No, well, there's not. Do, 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 do. There. I'm gonna heal up. <laughs> I'll beat the the. Eighth and final gym later. Alright, let's win. Do, do, do. Oh, there they are. Over 
here. Well, if it isn't Danny, I expect nothing less from you and your Charizard, Leon. You took down that Dynamax Pokemon in no time at all. Well, I am the unbeatable champion after all, Kakashi. But what is what all is going on here? An overflowing red light? Pokemon Dynamaxing without a power spot? Yeah, but why? I'm not su I'm not sure what's go what's going on. That red light could suddenly appear again at any time, and we'd we'd have no way of knowing. But being a but being able to predict such things is part of a scientist's work. Grand? The chairman called for me. He wanted to know all about Red Light's relationship to the Dynamax Phenom. Did the chairman know anything? Nothing worth my time. The chairman's all wrapped up in fretting over the future of their energy, apparently. He's left everything to the executive leader, lady. We just don't have enough data. That's why I wanted to ask you to start looking into things too, Sonya. You know more than anyone about the darkest day, after all. Are you saying that red light and the darkest day are connected? Hey, do you reckon there's anything we could do to help out? There must be. Thanks, I appreciate this. the thought, Kakashi. But all I could have ever asked of you would be that you join me in the greatest final match ever. I'll do my part to make that happen by keeping everyone's future safe, Kakashi. So you just keep on doing your part by winning your way through the gym challenge. Right, of course. You're the unbeatable champion after all, eh? Grand, there's something I want to look into. You'll help me, right? Naturally. Looks like we all know what we need to do so you two clear the gym challenge so we can meet again at the Champion Cup, Kakashi. I feel like he's better that way. I know what I need to do, alright. Defeat that Pierce once and for all. You're off to Hammerlock Stadium yet? Danny, Grihon's a tough nut to crack. Let's do it. The long gym challenge is near its end, I see. Are you ready to face the Hammerlock Gym and its leader, the Dragon user, Raihan? You bet I am. In that case, please cha use the changing room to change into your uniform. That uniform you wear is a symbol of all your victories. I feel your determination. Now head to where all the gym trainers await. No, not the stadium, but the vault. <coughs> <sighs> Let's see how many gym challengers are left. Huh? Not even ten? Eh? Alright then. Danny, time to explain the great Dry Hong's gym mission. The rules are simple. All you gotta do is defeat three gym trainers that I personally train in double battles. The gym challenge is meant to be, well, challenging, wouldn't you say? Naturally, there aren't too many gym challengers who can make it this far. And that's why I provide a format where you can really show off your brilliant combinations you and your Pokemon should be capable of. There's probably more than enough out of me. Time for someone else to take the spotlight. 
Come on, Sebastian, you'll be the first. You're next. Whoever's after you is next. And the person after that will be next as well. Yeah, that's me, Sebastian. Leader Raihan has taught me in two things. First, that dragon types are fiercely powerful. Second, I need to create advantage on the field, battlefield to fully utilize, utilize that power. I unfortunately can't speak right now. Yay! Sent out a Pelipper and Sligu. Okay, we definitely have an issue here. <coughs> Alright, Pokemon. I am going to switch to Toxtricity. Toxtricity of our city. Of our city. You worry on the world. Howdy on the disorder, disorder. Now somewhere between the sacred silence, the sacred silence and sleep. Oh, you're just trying to do that. Water pulse? My dude, are you trying to confuse me? Cause that's not gonna happen. You're not gonna win though. <laughs> Dazzling Gleam! <laughs> I'm still faster, so it does not matter. You're gonna lose. Overdrive's gonna win. Go, Tastricity. I really don't have to hit you with uh, my Pokemon. <laughs> My Galarian Rapidash, no. All I have to do is defeat you with Toxtricity and it's over. Um, no. Yes. <coughs> Beat S tri Gym Challengers. Gym Chainer Sebastian. Doubles. There's a lot to think about with them. It makes them difficult, but fun too. Yeah, definitely fun when I wreck you and you're shocked. I can see why you've managed to make it this far. Time to face the second trainer. Come on, Camilla. In double battles, it is important to figure out what role each of your po opponent's Pokemon play. Okay. Show me what you got. Ninetales and Turninator. Turninator. And Drought. Well, that's gonna be fun. I think I'm gonna use Dirt Shop on Turninator. And high power power on that nine tails. Rapidash is fifty two. You shell trap. Oh. It did some damage. Cool. Use the shell trap again. But technically, I don't really have to do worry about it because psychic. <laughs> Yep, I think we're going to just keep doing this first impression and psychic. Oh, uh, that's as long as we can Should have known that that was what it was using. <laughs> I 
Hey, yeah, special attack, my dude. Tell you it's 54. No. <coughs> Keep the old moves. Do, 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 do. The weather is fickle. Victory and defeat are even more fickle. Back off! Back off! Back off! Back off! Fantastic! I can see those seven badges you have well or ha you have were well earned. You've made it to the third and last trainer. Your moment to shine, Aria. <laughs> oh, God. A double battle? Do you combine the strength of two Pokemon to push through? Or do you have one of them support the other? Let's, let me see what your strategy is. <coughs> It's not really a dumb strategy, it's just destroying. Let's see. Abomina Snow and Haku Hak Hakuma. Hakuma. Oh, this is gonna be too easy. Hakuma Hakuma First impression on that Abomina Snow and Dazzling Green Gleam on everyone. Get that up on the snow out of here. It's gone. I don't even think that crit mattered. Because even if it did, it doesn't really matter. It was going to get destroyed anyways. Dazzling Gleam. Get this out of here. And if that was a crit, it didn't matter either. Quad, 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 uh, super effective. Cooperation between trainers and the Pokemon just bring brings out their strength even more. <coughs> well done. I am honored to have battled against such a talented trainer. Nice one, Danny. You completed my gym mission. Come on, time to head to the gym stadium. You've earned the right to face me yourself. Except for I don't trust you, my dude. So we're gonna start off with these guys. <sighs> Hyper potions to level get them back up. Ah, oh, it's getting this could be over. <laughs> Finally, a challenge challenger made it. I've been waiting for someone to battle. Though I've got to admit, I didn't think it would be you. But I guess I should have expected no less from a Pokemon trainer that Leon saw promising. And you aim to defeat Leon? Do you have any idea just how high a hurdle that is? As his greatest rival, I guess that I, Raihan, will have to show you. Gym leader Raihan doesn't simply control the weather, he also seeks two on two battles. You must be prepared for any situation against a foe like him. Send out a Gigalith and Flygon. Okay. Let the winds blow. Stream forward. Standstorm. Hmm. I can hit everyone with the freaking muddy water. <laughs> Get that fly gun out of here. Breaking swipe? Nothing. 
Oh, attack fell. Aquas. Charizard effect. Uh, Charizard avoided that attack. Kek, kek, kek. Muddy water again. Get them out of here. Show me your your two Pokemon. Deludon. And who else? Sandaconda. Okay, wait. I'm gonna use flamethrower on that Dur Duraludon. We're gonna use this and Max Geyser on that Sandaconda. We're gonna move. It does not matter. Two ninety two. Bring the storm, my partner will send everyone in the stadium fly. <sighs> it's a Gigantamax Jaraluda. Get out of here, Santa Conda. You're done. Get obliterated. The winds rise again. Stream forward, Sandstorm. I don't think he knows what he's up to. Enter. Max Rockfall. Oh god. Don't kill my Charizard. Oh, it did. That's fine. I have another Pokemon that's good at destroy this. You know what? I will use my. Valerian Rapidash. Get this out of here. It's okay. We already won, though. It's a little in over sight with him. And he's this. I can eat. It's gonna be Charizard. It's over. Hmm. <coughs> yep, we got Charizard 56 and Rapidash 53. You defeat Jim later round. I might have lost. But I still look good. Maybe I should snap a quick selfie. Do -do -do. In the aftermath of the fierce battle, I feel it was pure and refreshed as when the sky clears after a storm. What can I possibly say? Calling myself Leon's rival, 
seems I've grown quite conceited for someone who can't even claim the ch title of champion. Overconfident in both myself and my teams. I'll give you what you want then. The proof of your victory, the Dragon Badge. So two badges in in an episode. You can now catch Pokemon of any level. You've collected all the gym badges from the Galar region. Now win your way through the semifinals and finals for your chance to challenge Leon. You must. You owe us that much at least for beating us in the battles here today. You've collected all of the gym badges. At last, it's time for the Champion Cup. I look forward to seeing how you can, how you all do in battle. Hey, Danny. Sorry to hold you up, but here, there was something I forgot. First off, as a sign of my respect, here, TM99. It contains the moves breaking swipe. This user swings his tail wildly and attacks opposing Pokemon. This also lowers their attack stats. And secondly, here's the dragon type gym uniform, the mark of ultimate strength. Number 13, Challenger Danny. You've completed the gym challenge. Go, good on you, kid. Now prove your strength to the whole region at the Champion Cup. Ryan, I'm here to see just how good you are. There you are, Leon's little, Leon's little brother. Don't worry, I've, I'll give you a battle to make you want to quit the gym challenge altogether. I've tried out lots of different strategies and I've made up my mind about how I want to battle. I'm not going to lose. I'm going to beat you and Danny and even Lee. I'll be seeing you, Danny. Let's have another epic battle someday. If you're feeling up to it, you might want to go to train hard in the wild area. And with that, we are done. We are ending this episode off. Thank you guys for joining us. We did two gym battles in one. Thank you guys for joining us today.